Hey, Manahawkin community. It's Dr. Nicole Bonner with Healing Hands in Manahawkin. And I'm just, I've been wanting to do this video for you guys for such a long time because there are so many of you that are suffering needlessly with long term chronic inflammatory diseases and illnesses. And there are four things. How many? Four things that if we all did these four things, we would eliminate probably 50% or more of the chronic diseases and illnesses that people suffer with every day. So we're gonna do a video series. We're gonna do a four step video series on these four things that I promise if you do, did, if you were to do these four things, and I, I dare you to just try, I challenge you to just try it for just 90 days, these four things, I guarantee your overall health will be significantly better. So are you wondering what those four things are? All right, so here we go. Number one is regular chiropractic care. Come on, guys. You knew I was going to tell you regular chiropractic care. So in the next video, I'm going to share with you why that's so important. But I'm going to give you a little bit of hint, a little bit of a hint. Remember, the one organ in your body that controls the health and the function and the healing of, of all the other organs in your body is your brain. And your brain is connected to your body through your spinal cord. And your spinal cord lives inside of your spinal bones or your spinal column, right? So in order to have a healthy functioning body, in order to have organs that self-heal and self-regulate, you have to have a healthy spinal cord because your spinal cord has to transmit information from your brain to the rest of the body. And if, it, and if it's unable to do that, that's when we have problems. The body cannot communicate, the body cannot regulate, the body cannot coordinate, and the body cannot adapt. And if our body cannot adapt long enough, it creates chronic inflammatory disease, like um, autoimmune diseases and, and, and um, diabetes and asthma and heart disease and cancer and all kinds of unwanted health conditions, right? So how does that work? Well, through different stresses and traumas that we all have, it forces the spinal column to shift out of its normal alignment. And when that happens, that shift or that twist causes a massive amount of stress on the spinal cord. The spinal cord begins to break down, it doesn't function properly, and then it stops transmitting information clearly from the brain to the body. And that's what creates the chronic disease and inflammation in the body. All right, so step number two, remember I told you that there's four, we're on step number two, simply eating real food. Simply eating real food. Better if it's organic, but I'll just take real food. What does that mean? Like, well, well, doc, I eat real food every day. No, you probably don't. Anything that is in, in a box, anything that comes in a box, anything that comes in a bag is not real food. What are your real foods? Well, the real, real food is anything that comes from nature. An animal, sorry about, sorry about animal lovers and vegans, but animal um, and vegetables, plants, fruits, all right? That's real food. That's stuff that comes from nature. It comes from the earth. That is what is meant to provide the vitamins, minerals, and nutrients that our body needs. And we'll be, we'll do a whole video just on eating real foods, where to get it, um, how to do it on a budget. So we're going to talk about that as well, because I, you can probably imagine the number one um, objection to eating real food that I get is, um, is money, right? But I will guarantee that your disease is costing you way more in money and also psychologically, emotionally, and in your relationships than eating real food is. I will guarantee it each and every time. Okay, step number three, exercise. So we're gonna do a whole video just on exercise, right? But you have to move your body. 
You have to move your body. That's all there is to it. Motion is life. Motion is life. So every single day, you have to move your body every single day. Now, you don't have to be a world-class um, power lifter or a world-class athlete or anything like that. Find stuff that you enjoy doing and get out and, and do it. You know, make it a challenge. Get a partner. Find somebody that you like to, to spend time with and, and get out there and get moving. Your heart relies upon it. Your nervous system relies upon it. And every single cell in your body has to stay in motion to restore your youth and maintain your vitality. And number four, step number four. What is step number four? Come on, I didn't forget. Hydration, 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 hydration. Guys, over 75% of your body is water. You hear this every day. Everybody already knows this, right? So what does that mean? Well, as you get older, your body is going to have a natural tendency to dehydrate. That's why we get ugh, wrinkles, right? So what does that mean? Well, drinking the proper amount of water is absolutely essential to the function of the cell. Like literally your cell uses water to be able to heal itself, to be able to regulate itself, and to be able to function. Um, water is absolutely essential. So a good hydrated body doesn't only give you really great glowing skin, it, it, it plays a role in just about every single function of your body. Every hormone that's produced, your body uses water to produce those hormones. Every bit of chemistry that your body produces and balances, it uses water. So hydration is very important. Keep an eye out for our series, our next four videos, because we're going to dive a little bit deeper in each one of these things. But if you did, I, I, I challenge you to do these four things, regular chiropractic adjustments, um, eating real food, keeping hydrated, and moving your body. If you did those four things, I'm challenging you to do this for the next 12 weeks or 90 days. If you do those four things, I bet your life would completely transform. Mm -hmm.